All right, so this week my favorite theme park, Silverwood Theme Park, has uh, opened. I was hoping to go this weekend, but um, I wanted to uh, go on the way there. Ellensburg is on the way, and there's a favorite vantage point where I like to get photographs of the night sky. And the weather is not very great over there, I, so hopefully next weekend I'll go to my favorite vantage point and then go on to uh, Silverwood Theme Park. But it reminds me of a wish I once had while I was at Silverwood Theme Park. I wanted to break a world record for the most times on the ride of Spin Cycle in one day. And the reason for that is Spin Cycle was the only uh, ride of its kind that goes 360 degrees, the full circle. And um, I just thought that would make an interesting Guinness World Record. Um, and I thought that um, it, it would uh, help advertise the park as well. So it's a win-win, right? The problem is that the, the time I went there, I, I can't remember what, what time of the year it was, but it took two hours to wait in line. And I remember thinking to myself, maybe one day there'll be some kind of an event and people won't want to come to Silverwood because they need to tend to this event. Maybe some world leader shows up in Coeur d'Alene, which is where the park is. And they uh, they all want to tend to that. And then I could have the theme park to myself, or at least it would be very sparse, right? Well, in 2021, that event has come. Not the, not the best event in the world to cause that. Okay, and then three years ago, I was at a Computer Olympiad conference and it was held in Macau which is not exactly my favorite choice uh, for a vacation destination I couldn't find a lot of my favorite foods I'm not a gambler so that Macau just isn't for me and I, I used to have a big fear of loud environments like that and I, I was cussing at the whole trip and um, I think I blurted out that why can't we have these conferences somewhere where I actually like to travel, like for example the Rocky Mountains. And uh, most of my opponents were from Europe, from Asia, they had no idea what the Rocky Mountains were. And uh, my opponent joked to me that maybe uh, if I had like about $100,000 I could sponsor that event anywhere I wanted to. And if the, if the Rocky Mountains were that interesting they might consider it. Well, in 2020, I got my wish. I had the Computer Olympiad in the Rocky Mountains online, of course, right? Anyways, just a, a cautionary tale. Be careful what you wish for.